Tonight we meet our own Dave Goldman as trails end under the Burled Arch in Nome. And he is joined by this year's champion. Take it away, Dave. Okay, Joe and Bonnie, thank you. Uh, Joe, you mentioned a moment ago that uh, Mitch finished here uh, not too long ago with 11 dogs. I got to tell you, first of all, thank you for joining us. I know it's a little long week. You're tired. Uh, it looked like you had 111 dogs the way you just blew through everything. I mean, how how is it that your team was this good, this fast for this long? Well, it's a phenomenal group. Of course, we've been working on sled dogs for decades, but this is a phenomenal group. And I don't know, it seemed to me like we found a different, a different level of connection with the team this time and they were just having so much fun I couldn't hardly slow them down and that sounds like bravado on a thousand mile race but it's the truth um, they just wanted to go fast and they stayed healthy um, we didn't have you know any real problems and and uh, I'm not sure what happened here we are <laughs> a number of times you said to us that on the trail you said I'm not asking them to do anything that, that we haven't trained for this is what they expect to do is to go this speed right we train the speed into them they understand the run rest cycles that we do and I don't really ask my dogs for speed or you know, I don't really drive them. I'm along for the ride and, and I think they're happy they brought me. I do all the dishes and clean and cook and feed them. But uh, it's just what we do and they were comfortable doing it. And uh, now you have uh, another title, three for you, yeah. Dallas for four. He's looking to make it second. Um, your family name is an absolute machine. Of course, your dad danced starting in 1973 with yeah. this race. Uh, your family is a dynasty. You're a machine. Uh, what is it about this group that just keeps making you guys better and better? Well, we get we have the right energy going on in the kennel. We, have, you know, and Dallas has his own kennel. Um, so once you get something started in the right direction, you can you know facilitate the growth there. But it's it's a hundred percent commitment to sled dogs. I mean, that's all we do. We do, you know, racing in the winter and tours in the summer, and we give, we teach people how to mush, and we lease out teams, and everything's about sled dogs. And so, you know, my appreciation is to the Alaskan Husky and to our, our brand of dogs. Well, nobody does it better, and we thank you for staying up with us here. I know okay. you'd like to get some sleep.